I'm Roland Dickey from Dickey's Barbecue, and my, I'm here today to talk about franchising. Dickey started franchising 20 years ago. We've grown to the biggest barbecue chain, the only nationwide barbecue chain, in fact, in the United States. We have 528 stores, and we open one new restaurant every week, sometimes two a week. We developed along the way bar Barbecue University, which is where people learn how to run a restaurant, learn how to run a barbecue restaurant anyway. So that, and that was done by us and my son. My son, Roland Dickey Jr., runs the company. He's the CEO. I'm the board chairman. I go around to ribbon cuttings, TV shows, radio shows, things like that, public relations for the company. I uh, started working in full time in this business when I was 21 years old. Before that, I worked part time since I was old enough to walk. So that's what I've, we've built company stores. We still have a lot of company stores, and we also have franchise stores. We have no outside ownership. The company's still owned by the Dickies like it always has been. We have no equity ownership from other equity funds, or, and we've not ever gone public. All, these, all those roads have been offer, offered to us, as you might well imagine. And so that's, that's what I'm here today to talk about how to start a franchise business, the ins and outs of franchising for folks here at this uh, breakfast that, that want to know. Along the way, my wife, for, former Dallas County Commissioner of eight years, Maureen Dickey, a great politician, she started a foundation with, with Dickies called Boots and Badges. What's that about? It's to help people, firefighters and policemen, dependents of those who've been hurt or unfortunately killed in the line of duty. There's lots of women and kids and men who are, whose wives and husbands have been killed as a fireman or a policeman. Quite often they have special needs that we can help them with, and that's what Boots and Badges is all about. We raise money, we take no salary, no, there's no administrative costs, anything like that. All the money we, we raise goes straight for those folks. And that's what my wife's charity is about, Boots and Badges. It's a great, uh, a great idea of hers to help people who are, are in need, the people who protect our society. But along the way, as I said, I, I uh, started the company along with my late brother. We still own it, and um, gosh, that's, uh, that's, that's what I'm here to talk about today.